Yo, what's going on, Sexy Sam Lime Squad? How you guys doing today? We're doing a ranked 1v1. I'm going to be playing all around today, but the reason I started the video so early is because I have an announcement. I opened a P.O. box. It was infinitely more money than I thought it would be. I thought it would be $100. Turns out it's $600. Anyways, it doesn't matter. I opened it. And um, now you guys can send me all sorts of things. You can send me exotic snacks. You can send me fan art. You can send me used toothpicks. Like You can send me anything you wanted to send me. And I'm going to open it on stream, obviously, so I can write off the P.O. box. Duh. I'm going to open it on stream, and we're going to have a good time with it. And, um, yeah, I'm super excited about it. I will put the P.O. box address in the description of all of my videos. And, or all of my videos from here on out, I should say. And, um, a pinned comment in this video. So it should be pretty fun. I'm playing Oleron, and I'm going to be a backdoor boy. Why am I going to be a backdoor boy? Well, because, like I said in the first video ever of this map, I think backdooring is going to be the meta of this map, and it's just what it is. I'm fighting Captain Twig? Oh, gosh. Oh gosh, it's my arch nemesis. Wait, last time we fought was like a long time ago. Me and Twiggy. Me and me and the Twigster. Last time we fought, it's been a while. Um, is my one? Yeah, I get one point in everything. I don't want to fight level one. Well, level three technically, I guess. But dude, this is this is OG as fuck. Me and Twig fighting on this map. Do not get too close to the flames. OG as fuck. I don't remember the last time uh I actually fought Twig. But I'm pretty sure it was I wanna say on this map. Not the last time we fought him, but the last time I beat him. We've only fought twice, though. I don't know where he is. Doing a, doing another buff. Oh, he did red. Okay, okay, okay. So I guess he started speed red. He lost XP from the wave, though. So I don't know if that play was worth it. He is going blue stone, which is not animosity, which is good for me, by the way. Mm. We both have pots ticking. Hmm. Oh, really? He had the mana for that? That's so insane that he had the mana for an alt, a one, a dash, and a two. With like just a split little sliver of mana left. That's so ridiculous. That being said, I am fighting a Medusa early game with blue stone so i don't really know what i expected because oleron is obviously a late game menace not an early game menace in fact i'd argue he's really shit at early games so why did i fight that great question i shouldn't have is the answer but regardless we back we back we back And now all the buffs in the game are gone, so I think we're just we're just farming and fighting. Mm, I want HP. Cause I'm gonna go animosity, right? I'm gonna go animosity. Well actually. The backdoor video was going to be a good idea, but now that I'm fighting Twig, I'm pretty sure Twig is my clickbait. So maybe we just play for the dub. Actually. Which, by the way, is still animosity. 
But maybe I don't have to go like crazy hard on the HP stacking to do it. Like I was originally thinking. Um, he's gonna press two on this minion wave and clear it pretty much instantly. This is going to be pretty annoying for me, I think. Kind of annoying. He's obviously going for my red. Perfect. Big kill, big kill. Big kill. Not only does that kill put me back into the game, which is gigantic, by the way, but it also... Um... Secures my red buff. I'm not gonna go for his red buff, because I feel like... You know, if he's... Obviously, he's Captain Twig, right? He's a pro player. He's an amazing dueler. Um, if I go over to his red and he sees me doing that because you can, you can see it because when you're dead, you can spectate tower. So he sees me going over to red. He'll just run straight there and I won't be able to do anything about it. I think it's much better for me to just secure my own red buff instead of risking something and having a red buff for the next fight. That we will inevitably have. I got his beads there, which is amazing. Unfortunately, I also used my alt. So if he wants to fight now, I'm pretty sure he'll win the fights. I'm gonna drop a ward right there. I'm also gonna let him push this wave. So I can just get this. Your middle tower is under attack. Ooh. Transcendence is online, boys. He's gonna be doing a lot of damage here. I will have my shell up in 30 seconds and I have my ult up in 10, so. When all that stuff comes up, that's when I, uh, that's when I go for the dubs. That's when I go for the fighting, the fighting play. Oh, that's not good. Well, I got outplayed there. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. I think I lose tower. He does so much damage. He had all of his Viper shots too, though. Oh, I didn't even stop his back there. Um, I really want... I really want to get my mid guard. What is he going right now? He's going defense. Okay, so him going defense... That's magic damage, so I obviously don't want that. I'll probably just go Aegis. 
He got Sunder. Hmm. So my next item is Telekines, and after that is Animosity. If I make it that far, that is. Because this is going to start being extremely difficult for me to do anything here. Mm, that red buff is spawning. Hmm. Oh, wow. He does 200 damage in auto. Transcendence is so strong. I think, um, I think magical lady season hunters are definitely the meta for this map. I'm going to need to do something though. Oh, he got energy of talisman. The talisman of energy. I don't know why I always mix that up. I always do. Level 17, I can get... Animosity. <clears throat> I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to do that, though. Is the thing. Mm. No, he is so fast. He's got that red buff on, so he really very easily can take tower here. Right, I do think this is a winning fight for me, though. Definitely was a winning fight for me, but ow. All right, I don't think I can actually get the tower here. If I could, it'd be really nice. But that being said, like even though I can't get the tower here. I did make a comeback in gold. That's really nice. I will pick this up. A little more gold for animosity. And a little bit more of a level for animosity. Just one more wave. And I should be able to get animosity and... Or get the gold and level for animosity, so... Very nice. Animosity Online, boys. That's a huge help for me. Just a gigantic help for me. And now, I go Telekines. Oh, he's getting Itch of All. Ooh, baby. Ooh, baby. Itch of All is going to be rough to beat. We just face tanked it. getting the other red right now I think we just let him 
I'm in full on defense mode right now. Full on defense. And like I said, backdooring is going to be the meta of this map, so I don't even. I wouldn't even be surprised if he turns the corner with his one on just trying to beat ass, you know what I mean? Ouch. Okay. I guess that red buff spawned. Why he dashed over there. Huge kill, dude. Huge kill. In fact, because I'm animosity build, that might even be a phoenix. That was a big kill, baby. And it's not might be a phoenix. It was a phoenix. Let's go, dude. There's that, and now I kind of want to go Toxic Blade, because it's a lot of uh, attack speed. And I'm feeling pretty good right now, man. Feeling pretty good. I cannot win an ult without, or I can't win a fight without my ult. So, just because I won last fight does not mean that I'm winning every fight. Keep that in mind. He's going Kins right now, and that's going to shred me. It's a really good last item for him. Okay. By the way, he's going to be at this red buff. Uh, I can win this game right here. I can't. He's faster than me. Hmm. Cannot win the game right here, unfortunately. I am doing pretty well though. I get some good Titan damage. Mm. Oh my God, he went Xy instead of Kins. So that's a that's a really big mistake. That's a huge mistake.
I can't do anything here. I have to back. It kind of sucks having to back there, but at the same time, it's, you know, it's acceptable. I had to use my alt to live. I really need to make sure I get this red buff, though, because I need to re-get that Phoenix ASAP. I'm assuming he's at the Phoenix right now, because it has one HP. He's half HP. He is not. He is not ready for this fight. Unless I severely fuck up, which obviously could happen. Oh, that's not good. I severely fucked up. Okay. Uh, well, I won the game because he didn't respect, I guess, all around damage. He didn't respect all around damage and he went to go push the wave, even though I have Bancrofts and I can lifesteal up and, uh, that's GG boys. That's GG. And that might be a plus 100. If that's a plus 100, I'm number one in the world again on this map. It's a plus 87. I'm number two in the world on this map. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It all of a sudden became super tryhard and less of a meme, but still super sick. Number two in the world. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, peace.